finally, last one. Hail Motter, grant me strength. These guys are getting bolder and bolder. Curse it, Crow! You will pay for what you've done! You and all of your brothers! <laughs> oh, I'll pay, huh? What more are you animals gonna charge me for? Ain't like I got much left. More will come! We will have the power of the Builder. The Gateway will be ours, and I will strip the flesh from the bones of your friends! Mark my words, Crow. I will have vengeance for Basilisk here. Jeez, talk, talk, talk. Besides, what friends? Demons, man. I never get any smarter. Talking to myself? Come on, Orion, to get it together. <sighs> okay, you were right. Maybe I do miss you. Stupid rabbit, rhino, the rest of you assholes. <sighs> Thief, stop her! Don't do it. Do not do it. Don't. We're on patrol. You're almost done. You can go home. Don't. Don't. God damn it all. Where'd you go? This way, through this alley! Get her! <laughs> Illusions really are fun, aren't they? Oh, nothing like the sight of gold. And how do we do it this time? Slide a hand, using an urchin to cause trouble, old school seduction. <laughs> Brian, always around when I don't need it. Also, is that really your concern? Well, if we're going to live in the scrapyard as neighbors, it might be. In case, you know, bounty hunters come knocking on my door again, or I have to change the locks again. Why, whatever could you be implying? I'm just an innocent drow facing discrimination. Ooh, and I'm a pretty princess from a faraway land covered in rainbows. Oh my, would that make me your dashing prince? Nora. Oh, calm down. It was just a bit of gold. I was hungry and needed some new warding for my place of residence tonight. I told you before, my church can provide you with food. Oh, you mean that delicious blend of, what was it? Gruel? Leftovers, boiled in water, or maybe milk if it's a good day. It's still honest. Aw, you think I'm honest? Oh, please, not by a long shot, but you could be. <laughs> Whatever you say, honey. Now, if you don't mind, I've got a long way to go for- There she is! Get her! Who's the guy? I don't know, get him too! What? Hey, hey, I'm not- Hey, hey, Nora! Have a good one though, love. See you around. Oh shit, not again. Ugh, ow. Gods, I hate fighting people. Oh yeah, I'm gonna take an oath to be non-lethal to humans unless they deserve it. Oh yeah, har har. I'm such an upstanding model citizen. Young me was such a bitch. Ouch. You should really get that looked at. Oh great, my guardian angel here to collect insurance instead of help. You think guardian angels get to wear anything cute? Because I'd look adorable in some holy robes, I bet. Not to point out the obvious, but you know, I, I am bleeding, right? I'd rather not waste any of my healing spells right now. You got a bandage? It'll cost you. Ah, uh, yeah, no. Flat fucking broken. You know it. That's what you get for being in such a big group. The treasure gets divided to all, no matter what they put in. Ugh, fine. I'll use my spell. Oh, come on now. You don't even want to offer anything else. I know what you're trying to do. What do you want? There's the Orion I love to tease. So, there's this job. Yep, using my healing spell. D just wait a moment. Jeez, you haven't even heard the job yet. Will we be stealing something? Well... Lay on hands, coming right up. Wait a second! <sighs> it's not what you think. Come on, you've known me for how long? You could give me the benefit of the doubt. Remember the last two times I gave you the benefit of the doubt? And I got stuck in a fighting pen against a hill giant in the first... With nothing but a spear? You won, didn't you? And it gave you enough money to get that house of yours. For the second time, when we had to save the world, and you led me into a cave full of cultists dedicated to the Sun Eater. Oh, <laughs> and I had to fight them all by myself because you didn't want to get blood on your nice clothes or something. The head cultist had a very valuable artifact in the Church of Lathander, wasn't it? Besides, you got that nice magic ring of resist fire, didn't you? Still wearing it, I see. You know, it's such a compliment to see you wearing jewelry I get for you. Oh, I hate when you do that. It was useful. Look, you can trust that I'll look out for myself and that you'll get something from this. Besides, you need the money, don't you? What are you getting at? Well, I just so happened to see that you lunatics, despite your best effort, barely have a few copper to scrape by. Everyone's gotta pay a price to live. And you don't want to lose the house. 
Come help me, and I'll make sure you have enough to get yourself at least another two months. How's about it? You are pure evil sometimes, you know that? <laughs> I love when you flirt back. Here's the bandage. You know, this time you can take some joy in the job, though. Oh? You see, I'm looking for a piece of Janari's bracelet. Janari? You mean one of the heroes from the Catalyst? You know, that ascended to godhood? If you believe the story, sure. Personally, I think she's just missed out on the best parts of life. I had a rumor for my little birds that the churches say she was one hell of a prude. The job? You know all work and no play is horrible for the skin. I can see under that helmet from this angle, you know. That poor handsome face has a new wrinkle. The fuck I do? There's no way I... <laughs> Damn it. Another point to me. <laughs> you really suck at this game. <laughs> Have been. Even before that night dragged you away from home. So, where do I come in? I mean, you're talking about stealing a holy artifact, and I refuse to help if you're robbing a church. My, oh my. I remember the young Orion tackling the streets with me. We were one hell of a team, and I seem to recall you had quite the sticky fingers. Now, a church's too much. That was decades ago. I live a different life now. You must be so bored, though. I don't want to rob a church. I can't. Well, lucky for you, we aren't dealing with a church. No, in fact, there's a smuggler moving the piece for a noble to add to their collection. Now, word is that it's a replica, of course. I mean, who just has this kind of artifact laying around? Regardless, we're just going to make sure to pose as the buyer with yours truly being the beautiful and naive liaison, buying it for her dear true love. And you, as my dashing and holy bodyguard, the smuggler will eat it up, sell it to us, and we leave. I then hand it over to the Church of Gond, paying me to acquire it. Since Janari was an artificer as well, they want to preserve her artifacts. Even if it is a replica, it'll do until the real ones can be recovered. I say this with a moderate level of intended offense. With only minimal taken personally. But I'm broke, and I doubt you have any kind of money laying around. Plus, why would he hand it over to us? True. But that's where this comes in. Tin coins painted gold and enchanted with fool's gold for a bit of extra effect. Boom! Instant 150 gold coins. The buyer already paid, but this will grease palms for the smuggler. For the second part, because the buyer was sending a young woman and bodyguard, whom I've already dropped and tucked away for the time being. There's a lot of variables here to account for. I'll up the pay to four months of your bills. Let's fucking do this. Ooh, new toy. Birthday gift from the artificer I work with. Look at you, all nice and snazzy. Don't I feel safe with such a bodyguard? Yeah, yeah, laugh it up. What's with the mask? Precaution. If you say so. Is that the guy? Indeed he is. Looks like he's got two guards as well. Let's put on our best face, or in your case, helmet. Ha <laughs> ha. Let's get this over with. yoo -hoo. Mm. You must be Mr. Felix, correct? A pleasure. I don't record her in any entertainment from Madame Ivory's parlor. What's with the mask? Oh, nonsense. My name's Velvet, Velvet Von Fennec. The one that purchased your right to have interest is my husband. I'm here to pick up the artifact in order to surprise my love with it. Besides, aren't masks just so fun? Ah, oh, really? Because I was under the impression that Velvet was an elf, not a drow. You do know that drows are elves, though, right? Hey, you tree fuckers all look the same to me. <clears throat> right. Well, the merchandise, if you so please, so I can continue with my evening and dwell on this no longer. Sure, fine, whatever. Where's my gold? The item's been paid for. Unless you mean your bonus. Yeah, it's your grass munches is slow. Yes, my bonus. Come on, time's money, elf. Let's get moving. Right, of course. Julianus, if you would give the man his gold. There we go. Now that's what daddy likes to see. All right, finally. Dragonflies take forever, but... This is perfect. I'm sorry. What was that? Huh? Oh, I said you dragonflies take forever. What? You hear it off? Yes, it's a slur. No, I don't care. Conversation done, dragonfly. Hey, I was about to use try shut. No! Did he just. Wait a minute. Lord Fennec said your god was a mute. It's a ruse! Get him! Get him! Orion! You could have warned me I'm supposed to be a mute. I'm going for Felix! You take those guys! Nora! Ugh! Leaving me with all the real work again. Damn it! There's nowhere to run, Felix. Hand it over and you get to live. Not a chance, Dragonfly. You'll never get your hands on 
Nora. Hand it over, Felix. I won't ask a third time. God damn it. The boss is going to skin you alive, Nora. Are you really still chasing ghosts? She's dead, damn it. Are you going to disturb her grave again? I don't need a lecture. I won't let you go down this road again. Damn it, Felix. You should have just handed it over. <laughs> Nora. <laughs> don't do this. Just let her go. Sorry, Felix. But you know I can't do that. Wow, didn't expect you to have it in you. They're unconscious. I can't kill men just for doing their job. They haven't done anything irredeemable in front of me. Well, whatever. I got what I want. Time to take this to the church. Judging by your lack of awe, I'm assuming just a replica. Hmm. You know me, Orion. I don't really care much for whatever game the gods play. Replica or not, the church's playing Penty. Now, how's about we go and celebrate after? Gods, no. I'm not looking to lose my pants and my coin purse again. Just the money, and I'll be on my way. Oh, boo. And I was so looking forward to stealing another pair of pants. <laughs> what? Nothing. Three down. Thanks again, Orion. Just three more to go. I hope one day you'll forgive me.